You knew exactly how old she was because she told you straight away. How old was the decoy? 13. Uh, no, 15, sorry. 15 years old. Just keep off your phone, mate, please, yeah? No, I won't. You won't? No, I won't. You won't? No. Well, this is being videoed, yeah? So, you mess around on your phone, right? When the police come, yeah? Who looks like the person who's guilty then? If you're saying you've done nothing wrong, then you don't need to do anything with your phone, sir. So do you go on that site often? Eh? I mean, I'm just trying to have a polite conversation with you. I don't want to talk to you, eh? Well, that's fine. You don't have to talk to me. You know what I mean? I'm just saying, you know what I mean? Have you got family? You got sisters, brothers? Both of us sisters and brothers. Right. What would you do if you found out I was talking to them the way that you, well, supposedly you've been talking tonight? Go fucking mental, obviously. Well, exactly, sir. So I'm here to stop you from meeting a child. So you claimed there. Uh, like you're bringing stuff a change of clothes with you, yeah, for the hotel. I wasn't going to no hotel. This, I was... by the way, there's no point in hiding your face from this camera, mate. So what? I, I was going to it by coming anyway. Right. So what made you actually come then? I only came because I was going to go to town with my cousin. Yeah. Just uh, keep your hands out of your pockets, mate, because in case you pull anything out of your pockets, you know what I mean. You wouldn't want me reaching my pockets, would you? No. No, exactly. You know what I mean. See, the problem that we have here is that you've came to meet a girl. Now, like I say, the pictures are for the police. I wasn't going to meet the girl right. at the whole point. I right. was going to back home. So what were you going to do if, if why, why were you here? Like, like I wasn't here. I was going to go straight back home. After you met her and talked to no, her? No, I was, wasn't even going to turn up because, because my sister said, Michael, don't go. Yeah. So I was just going to go straight back home anyway. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that, that's fine, you know what I mean? And I'm um, just, don't, don't reach in your back pockets or anything, mate. You do not want me reaching in my pockets, and I don't want you reaching in yours. Right? Because if you pull something out of your pocket, then obviously it's things are going to up rile, aren't they? And the last thing you want, sir, is to get confrontational. <sighs> See, like, the problem that we have is you're here, yeah? I don't have no problem, I was... No, 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 I'm just saying, do you anyway? must live really close to me, I'm guessing just down the corner there, yeah? Am I right? Yeah, yeah I, live. I am right, yeah. Yeah, exactly, sir. You knew exactly how old she was, sir, right? You can say you weren't going to do anything, you can say you weren't coming to meet her. But you were in the place at the right time, what about this then, sir? What uh, you said, you know we're going to have sex, right? She said, what if I say no? You said, what did you say, sir? No means yes. Do you know what that is? <coughs> That's fucking rape. I was going back home anyway. You were going back home, but you just seem to be here. I You're the same person here, was, in the picture. I was going to go straight back home. You've got the same number. Like if we rang your phone, it would probably ring, but you turned it off, haven't you? So we can't do that, can we? I was going straight back home now anyway. I've got no condoms. What's easy for you? Um, I've got no condoms. What's you easy for you? You were virgin. I was going straight back home now and anyway. I snogged someone, I But what were you doing here then? I, I wasn't there. doing here. I, I, well, what I, were you waiting over there for? Because I was going back home. So you what, you stand still while you're going home? No, because I was going home because I was talking to my friend. You were talking to your friend? Yeah, just like... Jessica, literally. Hey, have There's nobody else there, sir. There was earlier. Uh, I, 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 sir, we've been parked up there for I the last ten minutes. Is that, ver is that very um, appropriate to no. a 15 year old? No. Sir, we've been parked there for 10 minutes, really? we've seen you walk around here. So unless you've got an invisible friend, yeah, you were talking to no one. Oh, you yeah, were stood there. My head. Right, that's fine. But I can tell you now, you clearly weren't seeing anyone really? there and you weren't talking to anyone there. Wait until the police come then. Right. Right. You hear voices in your head? Mental health? Yes, because I've got mental health. What do you suffer with? Well, obviously I haven't been... You haven't been diagnosed? Diagnosed with nothing yet, but obviously I see... Well, I've got clinical stuff. depression I don't have any thoughts about Childs. Then obviously if I'm having voices in my head, bad things. But you weren't here to meet the kids, you just said that a couple minutes ago, so... The voices you were even head couldn't have been making you do this, because you didn't do it. 
so did you tell so, your sister about come to meet this child? No. But I thought she said she told you not to come. She told us not, not to go to the house at this time. That's what she told us. But I thought you were going home. I was going home. That's all. So do you live with your sister? I live with my two sisters and my mum. So you were at home. She told you not to go out, but you were going home. Doesn't leave in your home sort of defeat the object of going home. Yeah? I mean, you don't leave home to go home. Like, after I've done this, I'm going home. Yeah? Yeah, I know. Right, well, so... Well, wait until the police come, that's all I'm saying. That's all we're saying, wait until the police come. Well, that's all I'm saying. I'm just asking you to just be chilled. No, I won't be chilled. Well, don't be chilled then. So, on a serious note, yeah? Mm. Is that the first young person you've talked to online? No, I've talked to quite a few online, but obviously like, they've been older. No, but I mean like young. Yeah. Is that the first young yeah. person you've talked to and met? No, like I haven't met her. No, no, but I'm saying like that you've talked to then. Yeah, I've talked to her. Yeah. Right. On that note, I'm going to call you a liar. Yeah. I spoke to you in when the past. I first started this, but you didn't, you didn't communicate in a sexual manner. Sorry, but... One one thing one thing I would like to just point out is that a minute ago you said just wait until the police come. You weren't coming to meet anyone. Just wait until the police come. Right, we'll wait. So some people are after you in biker or something. Yeah, just for my offence lot of done um this thing last year. Obviously, I don't want to talk about it. No, no, that's fine. It's your personal business. One, one question I would like to <coughs> ask, if it's okay, you can just say no. Was it to relation to what we're talking to you about now? No. No, I'll try that. Something uh, totally different. That's, that's cool. That's what I'm saying. But, yeah, so what are them voices telling you to do right now? To stab you with two guys. Aye. Uh, so obviously I haven't got a knife, so I can't stab you. Aye. Uh, plus if you did have a knife, it wouldn't be a very wise thing to pull out. Will I have one, no, no, I'm just saying if you yeah. did. But obviously, why should obviously, obviously people have to suffer from mental health or? Well, yeah, of course they do. It's the way of the world. Why should you know they have I mean? to suffer from? Well, it doesn't matter, it? but you know what I mean. Uh, but why should people have to suffer from child abuse? You know that that there's more than mental health. Well, well, you know, people who get abused as children never live a normal life and some of them commit suicide for, well, obviously for I guess, um, meet a young girl, you know what I mean? And that's something that you, you know, if you have been abused, is something that you don't want to be doing to anyone else, surely. Well, exactly. But, I mean, you're here, aren't you? That's the problem. You know what I mean? Like, that's, that's the problem that we're facing, is that you're here. Yeah, yeah, he said, uh, he's, he's been telling us that he, uh, he's been hearing some voices and he's had to stab people, so... To show we pass that on. He said he hasn't, but I haven't been diagnosed or nothing. Like, yeah, uh, been diagnosed but you know, you never know. Yeah, he does. Yes, yeah. But we've uh, told him to keep his hands where we can see them, and he's been compliant with that. Okay. Thank you very much. Thanks. Bye. Related in any way to mental health, like. Want to come and meet this kid? Well, like, yeah, saying, because obviously the voices told me to come and meet this kid, and like anything what the voices tells me to do, I'd just go and do. Aye. Like obviously, if the voices went and told us to jump off a bridge, I probably would go and do it. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. What happened with that? Did you got a court or anything? Yeah, I went to court and I got a suspended sentence, and I got um, and obviously fines and whatnot. No, I never got fines. No. Oh, I no. Obviously, that was bad enough. What I've done in the first place. Yeah. So. So what? What? What uh, did you get? What sentence did you get? Um, I can't remember now. It's been ages. It's like a suspended sentence. Yes, suspended sentence. Did you get anything else? Yeah. And I've, I've got um, probation as well. Oh right. So. You get put on any harm prevention orders, right? Well? No, no, no. Like that, no. What did probation say about the depression and so on? Did they? Did they I'm supposed to go on this um, depression group. 
so my town I'm supposed to be starting it um, in the next few days or the next week or something so because it's probably best to get it addressed before no, yeah, yeah definitely if you're doing stuff like this you know what I mean like, this and then obviously like it's best to get my mental health sorted as well before I even well what happens if it was a real girl tonight, you know what but I mean? Exactly, but obviously it wasn't, so... It wasn't, luckily for you it wasn't. But obviously it wasn't, so... No, no, yeah, yeah no, I'm just saying, yeah. but I mean, if it was... I wouldn't jail for a very long time if it was. Right, you know what I mean, if it was a real... So, re obviously now, like, I couldn't be going to jail, though. No, but I'm but saying, but if it was, if it was a real girl, it would have been classed as rape, you know what I mean? And but then, obviously I haven't done nothing, No, so. yeah. But then you would have been looking at, like, seven years plus mm. in prison, you know what I mean? And well, you wouldn't yeah, want yeah. that. I, obviously I just... Want to go back home and just have a chill night? Yeah. Will I, will I obviously be able to go back home later on or not? Or? Well. It's the bail, you know. Right. Depends if the bail is. Yeah. Should I take my bag off for the police? They you probably wouldn't touch your, your touch your bag until they ask you to touch it, mate. Because right. if you start swinging that bag off your back now, <coughs> you'll have to explain them anyway. Right. Hi mate, Hi, basically right? um, Kent Meat Roy thinks there's a 15 year old child, child following sexual grooming. Okay, He's um, basically said he wants to take a, ho a hotel and uh, rooms in up in Elza. Right. Um, we met him here because we said we were getting taxi down. Right. Said he would walk down into town with her and obviously go to a hotel and whatnot and okay. uh, have sex. Right. Um, he claims to have some mental health be, issues as well about stabbing people right. and so on. Um, said, said um, he had mental health issues. If he had a knife, he would uh, stab us. Right.